oh, I should probably grab my keys. Whew. Hey guys, what's up? Goose hunting time. So, I gotta get a few snacks and stuff for the field though. Not successful. Mm-hmm. You know, got the chalky milk. Honey bun, love these. And because I'm suffering today. <sighs> okay, anyway, hunting with Tristan today. Got a couple other guys, not sure who all is gonna be there, but they say we got a pretty good goose feed. It's an hour drive for me, I need to get going. Um, but what we are doing today is something I've wanted to try for a long time and I hope it doesn't fail miserably. We're gonna put an A-frame in the middle of a wheat field. Like not against an edge, not, we're putting an A-frame in the middle. And I've seen people, well, I shouldn't say I've seen people, I've heard of people doing it. I've heard of people saying it works great. I've heard of people saying that there's no way it works at all. Today, that's that's the whole thing about today is we're gonna see if we can just put an A-frame in the middle. We got lots of cedars. I got a whole truck bed full of evergreens uh, to blind this thing up with. Hopefully it works the way I want it to. Um, they also said there's a couple of hybrids in the field. You know, it's a needle in a haystack, but if there's a chance to get in a hybrid, who knows? Anyway, I need to get driving. I will catch you guys in the field. Hopefully while we're making the spread, I know we're running a little bit late, so it might be at shooting light before I actually pick up the camera again. But either way, I'm gonna get to eating, drinking, driving. That sounds way worse than it actually is, but I'll talk to you guys later. Specs. Knew they'd be specs. Well, maybe they'll give us a show. Specs are closed, just in case you didn't know. Ready to go. Ooh. <laughs> First birds are looking nice. <laughs> Anyone hear specs? Third one. Can I get a thumbs up for a triple? <sighs> oh, don't make me do this. You're a jerk. No, 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 no. There we go. The bird's coming. Ooh, there's one, two. I got two with me out here. That's good. <laughs> Smoking cripples. Yeah, I know we got. A, I know we got a cripple in that cornfield. That was fun. I don't know. Oh yeah, we got more birds coming. Like I said before, a frame middle of the field. I'm no complaints so far, but this is fun. Oh, 
Watch out, there's a speck in there. There's, hey, there's two, there's two. Watch out. There you go. Boom. Oh. I got two. That's cool. Oh look, we got hey, we got even more coming. Right there. Oh, right there. There's a lot of specks in there. Don't shoot those. What's behind him though? If you don't know what you're shooting, don't pull it. Better pick him up. Yeah, I'll go pick him up. Oh, a lot of birds. Hey, we got more coming to the left. That's cool. Those are specs. We got, a, we got a bunch more on the line right here, though. We got a bunch behind us. Oh, yeah. Oh, well, well, there's nothing here. Let's go get this other bird. No, don't you do it. Don't you do it. Here we go. Love these little birds. I gotta check the shot cam put to see if I killed him or if someone else did. My gun oil, my gun oil bag. I'm having some gun jamming issues. Anyway, let's go back. Let's look at the spread a little bit real quick. All right, we got about 30, 35 dozen dive bomb socks and sillos. Oh, isn't it pretty? It's amazing. We got these up in like, 20 minutes, 25 minutes. Let's go look at the blind. That's the part that yeah, I'm excited about. This blind though, literally two A-frames in the middle of a wheat field, wide open wheat field. It's one of those things I've always wanted to do, but always been afraid to. So far, might have to do that more. Well, we got a little lull in the action here. Basically the birds are jumping around. Hopefully the second fight will get here. There's been a bunch of birds coming around nine apparently. So we got a little bit of time. So we're gonna go down the line. We're gonna see what everyone's shooting. Because we can. What you got here? I'm shooting Stoger M3500. Ooh, that's a popular gun. Oh yeah. A lot of people have talked good about it. You like it? Yeah, I love it. It's right just on. nice. Yeah. It's not bad for Stock price. choke? Yes, sir. Stock choke. Eventually I'll get a pattern master. Ah, uh, Carlson, man. Uh, I mean, one of the two, we'll see. You got taking Tristan's side over there. I mean, depends on the budget. <laughs> depends on the budget. I hear you. I'm shooting the Revenant V3. Ooh. I yeah. have, actually, I've never seen one of those. Not a lot of people have them, but. That's, I'm blocking everything with my shadow here. Sorry about that. Yeah. That's pretty. You like the way it shoots? I love it. Got it from a pawn shop. Dude, pawn shop guns are like the most fun. Oh yeah. Either it's a heck of a deal or you're gonna wish that you never had bought oh, it. Yeah. But so far it's good for you, yeah? Oh great. Hasn't Sweet. Been jammed once. That's awesome. Yeah. Benelli, Super Black Eagle 3. Ooh. Fancy. I'm I'm fond of the gun myself. I got not gonna lie, that that's fun. But what's that? What? What 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 choke is that? That's stock. It's stock? Yeah. I just made myself look like an idiot. Never mind. Going on. And then the Black Eagle 2. Mm-hmm. I'm familiar. Yours is 
fancy. Oh, the camo job. Yeah. Well, it's old. What? What? Is... Aftermarket custom paint. Yep. <laughs> we were giving him crap earlier because he painted his choke, but you know, it's all good. I'm not sure. Yeah, that's right. <laughs> I'm just calling. You're just calling. I'm going to shoot two more birds in here and take my gun, yeah? Yep. Right on. That's, you know, if we get birds anyway. So, yep. Let's hurry up and wait. Oh, yeah. Nice thing. Shot Cam sent me this awesome little warmer here. Check this out. So, Shot Cam, cameras in general don't like cold. It holds a hand warmer right up against it. Keeps it all nice and cozy. Makes the battery life last so much longer when it's cold like this. It's awesome. I love it. Anyway, we got some birds there thinking about it. Hey, there's a single getting warm up. Specs, watch them. That sun is not friendly. No, Watch the specs, there's a couple in there. Way to smack him. Of course, the first bird I pull up on is the spec. Can't squeeze that one off. All right, no, there's two that fell. Anyway, a hey, couple more. What's that? That's a little bird. Holy He's cow. Tiny. We got bear. That's tiny. No. Mm -hmm. No band. I didn't shoot that. I didn't want to shoot the one that wasn't no, banded. There we go! Oh, Woo! Hey Tristan, I'm done. Gotta I'll give Tristan my gun. Time for him to shoot some birds. I only had, I only had Double! Thumbs up, right? All right, oh, yeah. so a shot cam footage from here on out is not me, okay? I shot my six, I'm done. My job just to run GoPro and call now. Hopefully that works. The boys dropped these two out. Oh, oh don't make me chase. Oh, you're running to me. Yeah, boy. Don't you fight me. No band. What about you, buddy? No band. All right. Let's go. Well, we are done picking everything up. I mean, I don't know. Tell me what you guys think. Was it a fluke? Did we do good? Could we have done better? I mean, obviously we didn't kill all of our birds, so we could have done better, but I thought it was pretty solid. But here are our birds. That's a good little pile. Not bad at all. Mm. Yeah, if you know, you know. Man, that was a fun hunt. That was a good one. We, uh, after everything said and done, we had 23 birds, which was it five guys shooting? After I shot my six, I gave my gun to Tristan, but of course, no more birds decided to come play. So, yeah, it's just those three volleys that we really shot into, other than the couple birds that I didn't shoot at. Um, yeah, we, we did pretty good, I think, especially for, and now maybe maybe a bunch of you guys do it. If you guys do hunt an A-frame in the middle of a naked field like that, which, I mean, I know wheat's not naked, but next to nothing. Uh, you need to drop me a comment. Tell me like what some of your tips and tricks are, because I mean this is the first time 
that really intentionally did that. Uh, normally we're up at least against a slough or a low area or something like that. Uh, this was just out in the middle, you guys saw that. Uh, let me know what you guys, you know, what you guys do. If you've had good luck, bad luck, I'm curious about it because it, it worked once, will it work twice, will it work five times? I know there's no secret weapon, will work all the time thing, uh, especially in goose hunting, but I'm kinda curious what you guys think. But anyway, a lot of the birds you saw tended to land on my side. Uh, the best that we can figure out is that's where the decoys were the thickest. I mean, we had a pretty good, you know, U-shape there. They went to it pretty well, but the majority of the birds tried to land on that left-hand side where the decoys were thickest. So I'm not sure if that's what the deal was or not. Well, apparently I got that phone call. Thanks. Thanks, honey. I appreciate it. Uh, I was talking to my wife there, in case you didn't know. Um, but yeah, I totally forgot my train of thought, what I was going to tell you guys at the end there. Um, but hey, I hunt in the middle of a field, a couple A-frames. I'm pretty stoked about it. Like, it turned out really, really well, I think. So, anyway, I hope you guys liked the video. If you did, you guys know the drill. Hit that thumbs up button. Subscribe if you haven't. We'll see you on the next one.